I really haven't got the use out of my BMW M3 that I'd hoped this year. So today, I took a day off work, there is a German car night tonight up at Caffeine and Machine, which is a fair old trek for me, three hours. So I thought what I'd do is I'd give the car a quick speed detail, hop in it, and let's get going. Enjoy the rest of this sunshine while we've still got it. I have just pulled over for a quick pit stop on the way because I'm getting a bit tired. I've got a safety first in it, don't drive tired and all that. So, quick pit stop. I would love for you guys though, during this video, to let me know your favorite car you see and also leave me a comment down below and let me know if you've enjoyed this style of video. It's been a while since I've busted out the vlog cam. I want to know if you guys enjoy it or not. We're going to be able to get to a lot of stuff this year and uh, I just need to know if you guys want to see it or not or if I'd leave the cameras at home and just go on my own. Uh, so yeah, let me know down below. Another reason I really wanted to come today is my Nürburgring trip has been cancelled because of the coronavirus uh, with the um, onset, the thing you have to stay at, like, later for, you know, like the, what's it called? Isolation period. None of us can afford to do that at the moment, so we've cancelled the trip until the restrictions lit, let up a little bit. So, German car night instead tonight. We'll get going in a minute. Just made it down to Caffeine and Machine. They've got all the tents out. A beautiful building. We'll have a proper look around at all the cars in a minute. But first, let's go find Lewis and Ben and uh, have a catch up with them. Look at the number plate on the uh, Yaris as well. GR Yaris. Um, Same with the squad over here. Lou, what did you go for? Uh, oh, oh, chick Mac. I, don't either, I still don't know what Chick Mac <laughs> is. But anyway, I reckon there's cheese in it. No. no. Don't film me that. It's, it's not an ASMR. <laughs> <laughs> what did you two go for? You got plain wings. Plain Jane. What, what did you go for? <laughs> Gotta be the buffalo in it. Buff that's what I've got. Okay, cool. <laughs> So we can officially start looking around now because we have eaten. There is a stunning Audi just here. Back with Lewis as always. Uh, hope everybody enjoyed his video of the cappuccino that should be live by now. So yeah, should be live by now. Sick. We've got a CS. Look like I'm wearing the same thing as well. Yeah. How have you got changed? The uh, CS M2 over here. Absolutely mega. M2 for fun. Very cool number plate. Very nice. Standard from the factory, I think. Mm. Oh wow, look at the interior. The suede wheel, carbon everything. Wow, it is a CS as well, the dashboard. Wow, that is super nice. I like this though, look at this. <laughs> Damn, my dad had these when I was younger. So sick. I look at them all the time, mate. I think they're so cool. God, look at the interior. That is sick. So cool. Look at that for a shot, mate. So this doesn't look German, but I'm not going to complain. I, he's, called, he's just called it a tea bucket. I know nothing about hot rods, but I'm going to assume it's a Ford Model A, maybe? Oh yeah, look at this. But that's not very comfortable. Oh no, it's like, it, there's fine sauce. Oh <laughs> uh, yeah. <laughs> look, look at this. What is that? It's a Volvo electric car, right? C63. Very cool. <laughs> don't tell, don't tell Tim. Look how cool this van is though. It's an old Bedford van. That is epic. Oh. Mmm. And ice cream tastes really good. Now this could be a cool project on the channel one day. This is so nice. E34 5 Series. It looks like a sport. Manual. That is so dope. And it looks like it's in Boston Green as well. The best colour ever. Sick. Then we've got the ATS Cups on a Mark 1 Golf. That is a throwback if I've ever seen one. That looks awesome. Mm. God, they're so cool. Another Mark 1 over here on BBS RSs. 
very, very, very nice. Very time period correct with all the original interior it looks like as well. Wow, look at that. Super low Mark II here. Pretty cool with the weird window blinds in the back. I like it. Stunning Mark I. GTI, I assume. Yeah, GTI on Porsche wheels. This is another throwback to me, my teenage years. <laughs> Good old days. Whoa, whose M3 is that? That's sick! Trash, trashy brakes. <laughs> Gorgeous 8 Series here. Wow, that is super nice. Followed by my favourite Porsche GT3. The dream. Right there. One day, mate. Don't. <laughs> it's a beautiful little Mark II here on a very shiny BBS RS. It's got a Nardi wheel in there as well. Really cool. And it's also got like retro fitted modern headlights, which means you'll probably be able to see it at night. Next to a couple of old Mercedes, looking very nice. Very cool. There's such a cool selection of cars up here. And everyone out just having food and drinks and chilling. It's great. Got two things. Apparently that's what they're called, apparently. Uh, but both pretty unique as well. And this is not kind of cool, cool, cool riding. But yeah, look at this. Fold down window screens and everything. Pretty mad. I mean, I wouldn't want one, but they are cool. Look at that thing. Whoa. Got orange Carmen gear on one of the stands here. Look at the, look at this place, man. I wish I didn't live three and a half hours away. Damn, it's so cool here. I've got two Alpinas here, a touring one and a non-touring. I drove one of these. It was the fastest thing I've ever driven. It was so good. And this is the one I want because we could put Finn in the back and go one million miles an hour in absolute comfort. And it'd be so sick one day. Look at how cool this is. Oh man, that is so dope. That is so cool. I actually tried to win this car. I don't know if this is the winner of it or if he's bought it, but like, this is this was a giveaway car at some point and it was so cool. It's got blitz wheels on it. Love it. So from this absolutely beautiful thing that I was I was looking at all while I was eating my chicken wings. This is a E36 M3 convertible manual. It is beautiful. I would love one of these one day. Oh my god, that is so cool. Danny's car just here, who we're with now. And then we've got super low seven series, followed by another super low seven series just here. Slam transporter gr yaris and we've got the audi r8 with the marlboro wrap very formula one-esque epic rally epic golf r estate slammed that looks pretty cool doesn't it wicked look, look at all of these cars vip that looks super cool the thing with the volkswagens and the audis and that you really just have to lower them on wheels and they look great super nice looking thing and here we have miss queen b's porsche 911 so she's actually here i didn't want to interrupt her i saw her pull in but she's having food now so i didn't want to uh interrupt her just yet but we'll try and say hello before we leave but her amazing porsche turbo absolutely glorious thing in the best color as well it's like I, greeny tinge, yeah it's like an olive green it's absolutely yeah. gorgeous look there's, there it is in the sun look you can see it properly oh, yeah, okay. Looks absolutely amazing. What a, what a beautiful looking machine. Whistles all the way. Nardi wheel as well, look. So if you want to see more on this thing, I'll leave her channel linked down below. She's uh, got the whole experience of buying it and all that sort of malarkey on there. So check it out, Queen B. Evo as well. That is super cool. I think, I think Queen B's got one. Is that hers as well? I don't know. She's got one of these as well. It might be hers as well. I don't know. I don't know what her number plate is on that, but super cool car here's a m5 with carbon everything <laughs> what a beast oh my goodness me that is so nice in red carbon roof carbon lips carbon spoilers carbon diffusers Yes, a little MG with a roll cage. Look at this. Oh, that's so cool. It's so tiny. This is probably about the same size as your cappuccino, isn't it? Yeah. Thereabouts. Whole foot. It's all removable flip front. Whole foot. Flip front.
Rad. Oh, he's got the twin cam lip. Twin cam lip. E93 over here looking badass. Wow, these wheels look amazing. Works, obviously. Looks great. <laughs> oh, Recaro seats as well. Stop it. Stop it. Wow, that is tasty. That is tasty. Hello, who owns this car? Could I steal your wheel specs, please? And it's got our oh, triple eights on them. Whew. Carbon everything as well. Look at this. Look at the interior. The dashboard's all carbon. Mmm. This is nice. Here we go. Here we go. Now we're talking. I'm slightly obsessed with these things. Absolutely insane cars. Is it Julia? Is that how it's pronounced? Julia? Quadrophilia. Yeah, but it's a Julia, isn't it? Like. Quadrophilia is like the type R bit, isn't it? Even the way it's great. Mad car. I love them. I want watch, one. You should go watch a video of them driving around. The guy driving in just t-shirts and shorts in an Erberg ring. I'll, I'll leave it linked down oh, below. Because so this is what we watch a lot of. <laughs> so, savage. I love E46 looking like it's got some secret spec on there. Uh, I reckon that's packing. I reckon that's packing some heat. Look at the minivan. Wow, that's so cool. And then we've got another little mini next to it. Oh my god, I love the van. That is so sick. It's so tiny. <laughs> That's what cars used to be. Oh man. E36, style 66s. What more do you need? Perfect. Is it Boston Green? And it's Boston Green. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> I couldn't see it from my sunglasses. Hang on, you probably owned it. Not that one, I haven't. So we have here, beautiful S13. Super clean looking. Almost looks OEM-ish. Kind of got a Type X kit on it. Really nice, lovely color. Love that, beautiful. Here we have a standard Corrado VR6 Storm Editions. I don't know what that means, but to see him on standard is so cool now. BBS wheels. Man, what an old, what a cool thing. What a cool thing that is. Super clean as well. But someone loves this. You know that is someone's pride and joy right there. Getting around, oh, old Phil Morrison of Driftworks is Impala over here. Insane looking thing, very dusty. I think it must have been here a little while, but um, I know he's local and knows the guys that run this place. Um, also, if anybody's interested in finding out more about Caffeine and Machine, they haven't asked, like, they don't even know I'm here, like, but um, I'm gonna leave a link down below with this wicked video I watched last night, uh, explaining all about this place, how they chose to put it all together and stuff. It's really interesting. I think it'll make you wanna come down here too. So, that'd be cool. Gotta support places like this because we need it. My dad had one of these when we were younger. I had a green one. I remember him bringing it home and had the roof down everywhere. But this is the contrast of cars that we go, we've got old BMWs and this is absolutely gorgeous by the way. A state E34, stunning. That black Ferrari. Okay, that's the, that's the difference here. Left hand drive, bit, uh, oh, where is that even from? From O2 land. <laughs> e6 over here. This is such a variety of styles of cars. This is just a haven for car enthusiasts and I love it. Now this is sick. Z3M. I think it's actually a Japanese import. I've seen this on car throws, got T37s on it. Corbu seats, manual, personal steering wheel. What a cool thing. What a cool car. <laughs> That's so sick. Love it. Look at the Yaris GR Lewis, mate. Look at the Yaris GR Lewis, mate. Look at the That beautiful pearl paint. Amazing little cars. So good. So crazy. Old Mark 15 old man. Now this brings back memories, old Ronnie. Oh god, I miss him. Let's look inside. Oh, I need to zoom out a little bit for you guys. Oh god, they're so cool and they're so funny and they smell so good. Oh, I miss it so much. I miss Ronnie. So I had, I think it was identical roof rack to this. Man, this is such a throwback. I've got such a smile on my face right now. This is so good, man.
this Mr. Al Clark's 911? It looks like it, with the spec. <laughs> Look at the wheels, man. Oh my god, Al. I think we should ban Al from buying cars for a little bit because he's got too many good ones. Wow, oh, that is so cool. I'm the best sound instrument. Wow. What a lineup of vehicles that man has. I hope that is his car now, I said that. I think it is. Wow, that's so cool. So Al was on the track day video that's gonna be up in the top corner right now with us in his A86. This is his 911 GT3. Fuck that guy. I think we can just leave it at that. <laughs> and here is an E36 convertible that I saw at the tuck show on the weekend. I didn't do a vlog there. It was too hot, I couldn't be asked. But it looks very cool. Very, very nice looking thing. Very clean. Sick. Another beautiful Mark 1 GTI. There's too many of these here, man. They're so nice. BBS RSs again. Oh yeah, interior. Perfect. Love it. Fraser's just turned up. He was in my DMs kicking off. I didn't tell him I was down here. That's his, uh, his latest purchase. Some, what, what is this? Fraser, what is it? A Varosa. A Varosa, that's the one. So hi Fraser, how are you? I'm good mate, oh, yourself? Yeah, yeah, I'm right man. Oh, it's the ting. Where, smells, smells hot. Where, and this is the trick, this is, this is, this is where, this is all the good Yeah, 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 you just unplug that. That's, that's it. You just, you know, blank that and then. <laughs> don't even blank it mate, don't even blank it, just undo it. Ooh. These are kind of cool, aren't they? 1J big machines. Now, I've seen a few of these before. I think there's a guy over in Ireland that I did a video on an EF Civics, and I've got a purple one of these. It's pretty nice. Bizarre looking car. What do you think? Leave a comment down below. Let us know if you like it or not. So there's these two new Volkswagen vans up at Caffeine and Machine today. I assume they're all electric because of how they look, but uh, they look, to me, quite Peugeot-y. You can uh, let me know what you think down below, but it looks like a Peugeot to me. That's what I thought it was when I first saw it, so yeah, pretty cool though. just about 10 p.m. It has been amazing down here. I love it so much. I'm actually gutted that I live so far away, but eh, who cares? I'm gonna make the journey down here again very soon. Now, me and my little old M3 are gonna have to make the journey home. We did get to catch up with a lot of people here today. It's been brilliant. Uh, we did catch up with Queen Bee and check her car out, but I didn't put the video on because, uh, wow, look at the rain. I didn't even realize it, was, it had rained. Um, yeah, I'm gonna shoot home. I've got an early start tomorrow. So thank you guys so much for watching. And from Caffeine and Machine, it has been an absolute pleasure. I'm looking forward to next time already. We're out. Please make sure to hit subscribe, leave a little like on the video if you enjoyed it, and let me know down below in the comments which car's been your favorite. I'll see you again soon. Peace.